Okay. <laughs> um, I thought I'd start off this one a little different. Um, as you've seen from the thumbnail and title. Yeah, title. <laughs> uh, as you've seen from the thumbnail and title, uh, I have some PSA returns. Yeah, I'm excited. Um, <laughs> yeah, I just, I kind of wanted to start off this one just by explaining why I haven't uploaded for a week and a bit now. Um, just been really, really busy. Basically, um, everything's like full flow back at work again. Uh, we're moving house. Uh, me and me and Burr, me and Mrs. Dryer are moving house. So um, I just saw I'd come in, say hello, say thanks for returning. Or um, if you're new, thanks for being new. And thanks for clicking on the video. It means a lot. It means so much. Um, <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to kind of show that um, even if you're based in the UK, you can have some PSA returns. Uh, I also wanted to show my hat. Yeah, I like this hat. I ordered this uh, just after I started YouTube. I thought it'd be like a nice little gimmick. Um, and it turned out, and I'm really happy with it. Oh my Jesus. <laughs> um, I've got some, in, in the PSA returns, I've got some really interesting cards. I've got some um, CD promo cards uh, that I pulled straight out of the CD promos. I still have the CDs. So I thought I'd show them off. I still have a full set here. Uh, they're waiting to go off to PSA as well. I've got a submission video coming up. I've got I've got loads of things to open. I just I need to get some more time. Uh, yeah. So yeah, let's let's just stop bantering and going on and whatever, and just go and open some Pokemon, huh? Yes. <laughs> Hello! I missed out in the intro just to say hello. Uh, my name's Pokerdryad. How are you doing? <laughs> um, so yes, if you can, um, I would I would very much appreciate if you could just hit the like button and click the subscribe if you are new. That would be grand. Thank you very much. <laughs> um, so yes, today PSA returns. I am I am excited. I'm all over the place. I don't know what's going on. So, um, I really need to tell you what might be coming in this set. And I thought there is no better time than to show you a CD promo. So this is a Japanese CD promo. This is what uh, the main event of the PSA returns are coming from. Basically, back in the day, in 1998, uh, Pikachu Records released this CD. Uh, there's like a nice little book in behind it. Uh, great art. I would recommend anybody to get one of these. They are amazing. Um, so yes, inside this is just the book, but inside this comes 11 cards. You heard me right, people, 11 cards. Uh, one of which is a shadowless English Pikachu, uh, yellow cheeks, of course. Um, this was just basically for the Japanese customer market to understand what an American or English, um, card look like and what all the things meant and what they did uh, so yeah that was just for them to understand it, it is an English card it has a an English back I will show you that in a second because I have the entire set in front of me and in this area here oh well there was like another little card as well just so I could show you in this area here is the other 10 cards from this set in the set includes a Charizard a Blastoise a Venusaur um, a card called Cool Porygon uh, a Hungry Snorlax, there's Arcanine Mewtwo, Mew, uh, two trainer cards as well. Um, yeah, amazing set. If you haven't heard about it already, you, wow, you, you need to go and read up because for the for the second ever print of the base set Charizard, Blastoise and Venusaur to, ha to be in the same set is, is very slept on, this, um, this promo, very, very slept on. Uh, but they are coming to the forefront now uh, with prices basically skyrocketing for PSA 10s of the Charizard, um, at least. So yes, inside of this, these cards came from there. Let me get rid of this for a second. Let me just throw that over there. These cards came from there. These are ready to go to PSA. I do have the PSA returns uh, just here. They are sealed. I don't know anything about them. Um, basically, the... The, there was a paper sticker on here that I had to rip off. It had my details on it. 
uh, just like this side as well is the same it ripped off a little bit of the paper but I haven't got into the box uh, again ripped off a little bit of the paper but no entrance into the box <laughs> um, so yes I feel like it should say that on my uh, Facebook or something no entrance into the box <laughs> So there's a Charizard. That could mean so many things. Um, there's the Charizard from this set. Let's get back on track. Uh, there is the Blastoise from this set with a beautiful swirl right there. Look at that. Uh, there is the Venusaur. The cool... Uh, no, sorry. Hungry Snorlax. Cool Porygon. Uh, trainer number one. I think this is Computer Error. This is either Energy Retrieval or Removal. Uh, this is an Arcanine. I love it. These um, non-holographics in this set are all glossy fronted. Um, if I was a madman, I would take them out of their sleeves and protective stuff and show you the glossiness. But I am not that mad. Um, this is probably the best Mew I've seen. Uh, they are all off cut or they are all chewed up on the back. But this one just looks... This is the closest I'm, I'm going to get to a PSA 10, I think. Uh, just mostly because any I've ever seen otherwise has been really badly miscut. Uh, just like this Mewtwo, uh, probably the best centering Mewtwo from this set I've seen. Um, I, I have actually seen a PSA 10 of this. Uh, it sold for £80 and I, I just... I was so scared to pull the trigger thinking that I was overpaying. And I haven't seen one since. Uh, which, you know, sometimes you just have to take the dive. Um, yeah, again, really, really good condition. So I'm hoping that this could be a 10 set. Uh, and then there is the Shadowless English Pikachu, which is nuts when you think about how much you already get to get something amazing like a Pikachu that is Shadowless, really, uh, like really sought after card. Wow. So yeah, a, a beautiful set. Um, I sent away two sets of the Charizard Venusaur Blastoise. Um, they look like this in a PSA 10. Here they are. I already had these. I think I bought this one for £35 around two years ago. Uh, this one I bought for £60 maybe a year ago. And this one <laughs> we won on bids for £44 around about a year ago, the same time as the Blastoise. Um, those prices now, uh, well, when we get into the box, I'll go through the prices of the cards and... and so basically I've got a piece of paper, I've done my research and basically just find out any any amount that they could have got 10, 9 and 8. So anything below that, I won't know the price, but you know, <laughs> I think I've done enough research for one day. Um, so yeah, so that is the uh, PSA 10 promos from this set. Basically, I want to replace these. So this is the new style of PSA uh, with, the, with the nice little stab, the QR code. Uh, these are lovely. Uh, this is the one before with the silver PSA stamp. Uh, there is no QR code. Um, that's pretty much the only difference there. And then this one doesn't even have a stamp and definitely doesn't have a QR code. Um, but yeah, it would be nice to have them all from the same era. So that's why I kind of want to change that up. I also have a random Arcanine from the set just sat around, a 10, uh, which is lovely to have sat around. So yeah, um, I think without further ado, I'm just going to have to get into the box. I'm going to uh, try and figure out a way to get into this box without damaging any of the cards. Uh, and then I'll bring you back. So yes, let's do this. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I have figured out a way to get into the box without damaging the inside. And here it is. Hopefully I can show you this. So, opening the box. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Only because this is like uh, the 15 cards uh, submission that you get with your membership. I'll try and do a submission video. It's really hard though because like it's so much work. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll, I'll go through it. I'll try and go through it with you guys. Um, sending from the UK is not easy. Uh, it's, it's, it's quite a lot more work than in America. So, if I lay the box like this. Oh, I think that's the... The Japanese Tyranitar sat there. <gasps> I'll, I'll open it upside down so that we just take them off and we show them one by one. So inside of this box, we get... Um, this just looks like a little bit of information about some PSA cards. Very nicely folded there. Looks very, very professional. <laughs> oh, wow. Straight through that. Oh, oh wow. Okay. Uh, we have some other information on the back of that one. Let's um, just put that over there. I'm going to have a nice little look through these after. 
but you have the privilege of pausing the video. This, I think, has the grades on it, so I'm not even going to open this, just in case. Um, so yeah, let's try and get these out without breaking anything. If I tilt that, perhaps I... <gasps> they fell out. I'm scared. Okay, all right. Oh, wow. Okay, nothing in the... Oh, hang on. We have bubble wrap. We all like a bit of bubble... Hang on, hang on. I'm going to crack it. Here we go, here we go. Oh, that's satisfying. Okay, okay. Oh, my lordy. So, no matter how many YouTube videos I have watched where people get PSA returns, uh, there is nothing like this feeling I'm getting right now. Um, I'm not even exaggerating. This is... This is something else. This this could make or break my my bank. <laughs> um, so yeah. Oh, I have no idea what order these are in. I, I'm guessing that they've put them in the order that I submitted them in. In which case, this might be a Charizard Reshiram full art. Um, this top card here, but this isn't mine. This is my friend's card. Hopefully, it did well. It looked amazing. I pre I tried to pre grade. Uh, all the cards before, oh my god, all the cards before we sent them off. I don't know how to do this and cover it. Oh, there we go, right. Oh, oh my god. Um, the amount of times I've seen other people do this, and, and like, now I know the feeling. It's just like, I'm shaking and everything. Um, so we have Charizard and Reshiram, the full art version, not the Rainbow Rare. Um, hopefully this gets a 10. This is for Bellers 91 Um I, I know, I, I know it's worth a 10. Come on, come on, what do we have? What do we have? Oh, <laughs> oh my God. So there you go, Bellers. Uh, you got a 10, my brother. So this in a 10, oh my God. First 10 is somebody else's. Damn it. <laughs> uh, this last sold on eBay for 100 pounds. 100 pounds. Uh, I remember us opening this box together um, and him pulling this and I was really jealous. Now I'm even more jealous. So that can stay over here. Um, I might make like a 10 stack. Uh, well, if there are more 10s. <laughs> so uh, to make this video not as long as possible, I'm just going to try and quick fire. But well done, Bellers. That is, um, I think this is going to be the first time you know. I might text you and just say that they've come back. Uh, but you need to watch my video to find out what you get. So this is a Sting Glass from the Elite Trainer Box of the Birds from Hidden Fates. Uh, I hope this is a 10. I pre-graded this one myself and I could see nothing. Uh, so hopefully... Oh, we got two 10s! <laughs> okay, oh my god, I need to put some things down. Woo. Okay, I'm shaking. Okay, we're two for two. We are two for two. This last sold on eBay. Oh, the last three solds were between 85 and 75 pounds. So the last three solds in a PSA 10 of this were between 75 and 85 pounds. So that is very, very nice. I probably won't sell these because I sent away the entire bird set from Hidden Fate. So hopefully I have a nice 10 cent. We never know. We never know. Uh, it's this side, isn't it? Yes, it is. So here is the GX version, just the regular old GX. Um, I thought if I was sending away the other ones, why not send away this one? Try and get the set. Oh, what do we get in this one? It is a... <laughs> three in a row. Last time I got three in a row of anything, it was the Guess the Energy game. And then I said, are you playing with my giblets? God knows what you're playing with now. You're playing with some stuff. <laughs> Oh, I need a change of pants. <laughs> okay, we got another 10. We have another 10. Uh, the last three solds of this version is between 35 and 50 pounds on eBay. Oh my God. Um, I don't want to push my luck anymore. That's three tens in a row. Whew. Okay, we have the full art version of the Zapdos, uh, Zapdos Moltres, and Articuno uh, from Hidden Fates. I am, I, no way. No, oh, oh, okay, okay, well, you can't, you can't be upset with a nine, you cannot be upset with a nine, um, might be centering, this side looks a little bit bigger than this side, it's really hard, when you pre-grade, um, you, you kind of look at the card and you think, oh, there's nothing wrong, and then when, when they come in this sort of plastic case, you kind of see things a lot easier, um, so I can easily see, or you can easily see on the camera that this side here is bigger than this side here. Um, but yeah, we'll move on from that one. That does not get in the 10 pile. Stay over here. Stay in your lane. <laughs> Very happy with a nine. Don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. Uh, nines of that one, I think 
they've got to be around 20 25 pound i think was the last sold i seen okay we have the rainbow rare the big one almost the biggest one i think other than the stained glass one only because i think just to get the stained glass one you have to pay a hundred pounds for the box now so that one might be a little bit more expensive than this one uh here is the rainbow rare zapdos moltres articuno and it's a 10 <laughs> wow um to send away just one of each and for three of them to come back in tens i mean this is this has to be some returns right i've never seen this this is this is craziness 15 cards sent off in all the first five cards there are four tens and one nine okay we have a japanese card okay i don't know what it is i'm going to cover it oh okay um let's say three four months ago i bought a japanese team rocket pack for 15 pounds i think they now sell for 50 pounds <laughs> or or maybe even more 60 pounds um so yeah this was sat around around a month ago um no two months ago it was just before the channel just before i started the channel uh, i wanted to see what was inside it so i opened it and then i pulled a <laughs> dark blastoise um so yeah anything from this would be great i think i pre-graded this a 10 yeah hang on two seconds i didn't see anything wrong with this card or maybe top to bottom but even in the case like i don't see anything so here we go can we keep the mint streak going <laughs> uh, near mint mint eight what the what's wrong with it maybe maybe the hollow bleed might be something to do with it there's a there's a there's a bit of hollow bleed going on i don't really know I'm shocked at that one really shocked but still happy still very happy um hang on if i push this over there push this over here push this up here i can get the eight up there oh let's not go on a downhill spiral now <laughs> so we have another english card whoa okay okay it's one of the one of the nicer cards um these these are the ones that i'm really happy about having in my collection um i'd like to keep these forever to be honest with you uh who doesn't like pikachu and in a shadowless version as well oh can we get a 10 can we get a <gasps> we got another 10 we've got another 10 are you joking oh my jesus i just oh i don't want this video to be too long but we got another 10 we got another 10 let's quick fire another one what's the we have another shadowless pikachu if that one was a 10 i'm seeing tens all day long let me um this this has to be right go on go on <laughs> yeah that's what i'm talking about okay whoa too many tens too many i need a drink <laughs> oh my god we got another 10 we have another 10 how many is this one two three four five six six out of eight are tens oh my jesus um so the shadowless pikachu i didn't even go through the prices uh a 10 shadowless pikachu is between 80 and 90 pounds 80 and 90 pounds 80 and 90 pounds uh, not that i'm gonna sell them but there they are anyway what is this card okay right we're getting into the cd promos now oh please be a 10 please be a 10 please be a 10. Oh! <laughs> right i if you've never seen a PSA returns before, um, please go and watch anyone else's first and then come back to this video. And then you'll realize that this just does not happen. I realize that these come in like brand new and you can just send them off and you're almost, you know, guaranteed at least a nine. But 10, 10, 10, 10, 10 just doesn't get seen. Does not, not even seen. Oh, Japanese CD promo Venusaur. The last three solds of this card in a 10 is £155 to £130. So £130 was uh, three sales ago. The next one after that was £139. And then the last to be sold on eBay was £155. I am holding that in my hands. Oh, 10 stack is going to be off the camera. I'm scared. I am scared about this, this returns. Oh, I'm shaking. Um... You're gonna have to bear with me with the shakes, but I can't help it. Um, we have another CD promo Venusaur. Hopefully, this this could be just as good. <laughs> oh my god! 
<laughs> oh my god, this is better than any opening I've ever done. I am fe- I am like my um my blood is like pumping around my body at 400 miles per hour and it's going to all orifices. <laughs> another 10. Again, another another 155 to 130 pound card just sat there. Just ridiculous. Oh. Now we're getting on to the Blastoise. So this this looks good. I mean, let's take a look at the back. Back looks good. Oh, can we get a 10 set? Can you imagine? Like, I was thinking that it was going to take me three CD promos to get one 10 set of all three of these cards. Now, for me to get one 10 in the Venusaur is amazing. To get two is unbelievable. What What is this Blastoise going to be? What? I mean, for anti-climax. Like, if if on my signboard there was the sound of, of um, excrement, I would put it on, on that that moving of the thumb. I would probably... I probably would have changed it to something a bit terrible. A six? What am I not seeing on this card? Centering, fantastic. The back, not a single mark. Strange. This one might be up for regrade. I might have to break this one open and regrade it. Unless there's something in it I just cannot see in the light. If you see anything on this card, tell me in the comments down below. Because six? Wow. Okay. Well, six can just stay off the screen. Um, I don't even have a price for six. Probably 50 pence. Um, here we go. Okay. Now, th this means a lot now. Uh, there's a lovely swirl right there as well. Oh, this... Yeah, see this six? Pfft, whatever. If this is a ten, it makes it makes the dream possible still. Here we go. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> Back on the ten train, baby! Yeah! Six. Bye-bye. Ten. Hello. <laughs> I, I realize this might seem like I'm getting overexcited, but this card... Uh, last three sales for a PSA 10 on eBay were between 100 and 139 pounds. Like, and and look at this stack of tens. I'm blown away, honestly. Hang on. So if that bottom card was the Tyranitar, these two cards here are going to be Charizards. Um, I am going to switch it up and take the Tyranitar before the other two um just to add to the suspense uh so here is the japanese neo destiny tyranitar uh made in 2001 i bought this card maybe four months ago for four pounds like four pounds and i looked over it i looked over the card it must have been 10 times trying to find out why the guy sold it to me for four pound I think a pack of Neo Destiny uh, Japanese, or Neo 4 as it's called, goes for 160 to 200 pounds. Obviously it has the chance in that pack for uh, a Shining Charizard, but to sell a Hollow from that pack for 4 pounds is ridiculous. So yeah, I looked over this card so many times and I thought, well, it's it's got to be in with a shape for at least a 9. So that's why I added it in. Oh, here we go. And we got a... A Gem Mint 10. A Gem Mint 10 from a £4 card. Are you joking me? Look at how many 10s we have. <laughs> um, so the Tyranitar. The last Tyranitar to sell in a 10 on eBay was £100. So this card here is now worth £100. I bought it for £4. That is the power of PSA. If you don't understand PSA already, go and do some research. If you're interested in any of it, I'm more than happy to answer questions. Put it down in the comments below. I will tell you ev everything I know. Knowledge knowledge to me is is everything, and, and I'll give it away for free. Oh, okay. So as if this isn't enough now, as if all of this isn't enough, plus the weird six, you know, uh, that, that might just go somewhere else. <laughs> 
As if all of that wasn't enough, we have two Charizards to finish it off, and they are gorgeous. I love this art. Um, I love this whole set. If I can get 110, just 110, it makes the entire PSA dream complete. I can, I can, I could not ask for anything more already. But if I get a 10, the house is coming down. So this one here is. Oh my god, it's a gem at 10! <laughs> yes! Okay, I, well, I, I'm sorry to my neighbours for how loud that was, but get in! Oh my god, 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 oh my god. We have a complete CD promo trio, Venusaur, Blastoise, and Charizard in tens from my own submission. This is from my own submission. Oh my god. Oh my god, they're mine. I did this. Me. Look what I did. Mum, come and have a look at what I did. Yeah, it's not a poo this time. It's some PSA cards. <laughs> wow. Um, Charizard, you stand there with Pikachu. Pikachu, this one is probably the most expensive card you have had on you. Oh my god. I need a second. I need a second. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Um, if you haven't already, please hit that like button, the subscribe button, everything. Tell your parents, tell your nan, tell your friends about this video. Get the information out there that UK PSA does happen. Uh, we have one card left. Don't go anywhere. Uh, 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 <laughs> um... I just want to say that that card in a PSA 10 last sold on eBay for £350. Yes, you heard me right. The last three solds, the first one was £176, the next one was £260, the last one was £350. I'm holding that bad boy. This again is a Charizard. Whoa, can we finish it off? Can we finish it off as strong as we started? Uh, I'm petering out. I have no energy left. I've just, I've just come back. I've finished work. I saw the box. I'm so excited. I don't know what's going on. I need to sleep after this. Can we? Can we do it? Oh, it's a nine. Uh, do you know what? I cannot be unhappy with a nine. I cannot be unhappy with a nine. We have a nine and a ten. Oh my word. Word Jesus. Everything. Pikachu, stand up. <laughs> Um, that can that can go in the well. It can't go in the nine pile. It's a Charizard. It needs to go over here. <laughs> nine and a ten. A nine and a ten. Are you playing with my tablets? Um, <laughs> I just need to come in like with a different kind of perspective because at that point I had absolutely no energy whatsoever. Everything was gone. I just released everything when I saw that ten. So the last nine to sell in this Charizard was 180 pounds. The last three, uh, the first one was 100 pounds. The one after that was 169 pounds. The one after that, a nine, a PSA nine of a card heavily printed, heavily sent to PSA. Um, 180 pounds for a nine. We have done well. We have done well. Now back to the video. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, wow. Wow, wow, wow. This 10 stack is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 cards high. 11 cards from 15 are 10s. That is some giblet playing. That is someone playing with my giblets right there. I mean, oh my God. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I don't think I've got anything in me left um, to go. Uh, <laughs> um... I hope to be getting out more videos. I'm really sorry about the stutteredness of the videos. I will try and do better. Um, as soon as the move is finished, I'm going to be full on YouTube. Um, everybody, smash the like button, the subscribe button, the notification bell, everything. Um, I can't thank everyone enough for what we've done so far. Um, wow. I will. I will give you one of these. A boom. And I'll, I'll catch you on the next one, guys. Love, love.